all right and we're back let's talk uh battle cat wait can we say that or do we just say it's codenamed something else okay let's call it this tom clancy's pvp experience that should be free and reminds you of other games click click allow all right feels good to be back so really briefly i'll go into it there was a rumor it seems like this rumor is 100 percent true i believe it came from and if i'm wrong in the name let me know in the comments but um zero bytes uh about a month ago really the kickoff of the summer was like hey listen there's a new game it's project called battle cat right and it's supposed to have splinter cell ghost recon breakpoint and the division even though those are third player third person games i apologize they are going to be you know it's going to be a first person shooter battle royale style some game modes in it and it's going to have characters from that universe so chances are we're not getting a splinter cell game a lot of people are looking for that and they put out this logo that you have that's you know this animated thing in the back now it doesn't it looks too fun again they said the wild side it looks too fun to be um i don't know anything other than like a battle royale it doesn't seem like this is what they would do for splinter cell it doesn't seem like this is what they would do for i mean i was also getting the vibe from watchdogs in here a little bit but i don't think it has anything to do with that because that wasn't the information that came out now they're supposed to have a press conference or reveal tomorrow. This all makes sense seeing that Rainbow Six Extraction. Let me know if I got the uh, comment or the title of the game wrong, but Rainbow Six Extraction was supposed to come out sooner than later. Now it's going to be later. I think it got pushed back to 2022 and it just makes sense. Like they're moving things around. You still have Heartlands that's coming out but it shouldn't be that because heartlands was supposed to be i don't know it felt like it was just in the division universe and what they said on twitter about this game is this will be in the tom clancy universe now tom clancy let me know in the comments if i'm wrong passed away what 2013 2012 something like that um the name carries over but people were like well maybe tom clancy doesn't want because of legal issues or money and all this other stuff a splinter cell no I, I believe his family or whoever has the rights to that and i think there was a conversation that ubisoft bought some of the rights to the name to do things so i don't know it just feels like this game is a battle royale this game is a uh, battle cat battle cats i don't not, i don't know if it's plural or whatever the case is so you're supposed to get a little bit of everything uh I, i'm if you remember the the stuff that was showed by um zero bytes i believe you even had cleaners and and other factions that were part of this now the game will allow i'm assuming different skill sets so i'm assuming like if you played breakpoint it's more tactical than the division which is squad and then splinter cell which is like stealth so i'm, I'm pretty sure that goes into it but i'm curious i mean what do you think it's going to be put in the comments it's not going to be a, a splinter cell and the modes that they were talking about that had leaked a month ago was escort and ringleader were two things where it's like you got to take a package to a certain area and then the other one was um like a death match or something like that where you have to like kill npcs or you have to kill enemies because i don't think there's any npcs in this i could be completely wrong which is fine but i like the fact that i just put it out here for the universe so could have been anywhere in the world and you're here we'll all find out very soon until next time Click, click, allow.